Yes, Ashley, Mike Murdoch at Bozard Ford Lincoln in St. Augustine. I've got the car on hold for you, and I will get it uh, detailed, filled with gas, ready to go. Just wanted you to know on 2013 or on older vehicles, um, they are sold as is, which just means it's beyond. It's out of uh, Hyundai's warranty or Genesis warranty, and I can send you the price if you guys want to get an extended service plan. But I always check out the car real good so you know the good and the bad. Um, being a nine-year-old vehicle, like I said, engine, transmission, AC is good. Just a little bit of oxidation on the grill, like I mentioned to you, and the headlights. Like I said, it looks like this one was replaced. Uh, this one needs to be cleaned or replaced. The body and everything checked out good. As I got a little closer, there is a ding or a little dent right below the headlight. Um, other than that, everything looked good. But I wanted to make sure you knew about um, this blemish right here. Let me know if you guys are okay with that. And I noticed on the tops of the mirrors, there's some oxidation. So paint has peeled off a little bit on the mirrors. And... I'm going to jump in and turn it on. Everything works as far as the AC and stereo and everything like that. But I did notice um, the power folding mirror when I was playing with it. So I want to make sure you notice that too. It has the touch button on the keys. Like I said, the mileage is low for the year. And it's push button. So, what I want you to notice, you got your power mirrors here. This is your power folding mirror switch. So if you notice on this side, your power folding mirror is no, isn't a problem. On this side, it does not work. So you can actually hear the motor. Sorry, it's got a CD player. Previous owner left their CD player in here. And you do have factory navigation. So, use the factory now. And like I said, your power mirrors are good, but this mirror is the one that is the issue. So, you can adjust your mirrors, and I can hear the motor going, but it's not going to uh, power fold on its own. The other side will. And then you still have adjustments. Both mirrors work fine. But you will hear this motor in here trying to work. And I don't know if it's a gear. You know that's kind of worn if it slipped off. But on these cars we don't want to spend a ton of money. And then it blows the price way out of whack. But the interior is in good shape. Doesn't smell. No animal smells or smoke smells. Like I said, all the windows work, no problem. Stereo works. We've got a little thing similar to uh, Mercedes and everything else. So you can choose. The other thing I noticed as well, I'm sorry because of the sun, the rear camera, you got a backup rear camera, and I noticed it's a little glitchy. So I'm just gonna pull up a little bit and put it in reverse. Uh, and maybe I'll have to come back out and send this to you at night. The car runs and drives great, but the rear view camera is a little glitchy and I did notice wear and tear up here on the dash. See, what a bit of a crack here, probably from the hot and cold, and a little bit of a crack up there. So you could get a dash cover. Mileage is 95, 281. I'll have them double check the tire pressure. You can see that kind of the tire pressure light. Um, everything else will be taken care of. And it has the easy entry, easy exit. But I just wanted you to see 
Um, if it's a deal breaker, I understand for the price of the car. Obviously, they're really hard to find in this price range. So sometimes there are some items that won't be perfect or not everything will function. So you'll see here, and then when I hit lock, this passenger side mirror will fold in. Um, but you notice on the driver's side, it won't fold. And you can actually hear the motor. But it will only fold by hand. So let me know if you're, you'll still be okay with that um, or what you want to do. The chrome trim, the rims, everything else is in good shape. And like I said, the car runs out well. But I didn't want to mislead you and you come here and get surprised by any issues. I want you to know everything. But give me a call. Let me know if you guys are still okay. And uh, I'll continue to hold it and meet you here Sunday. Thank you. 904-334-9889. Bye-bye.